Hi guys, I'm Shazad and welcome in AWS. Today we gonna install the Vesta control panel in our EC2 instance so you guys can easily understand. So if you are not familiar with that how can you create the EC2 instance, how can you create the Elastic IP, how can you connect your IP with your EC2 instance, so please watch our previous videos. I will also add the links in the descriptions below. Okay guys, so I am going to share my desktop so you guys can easily understand. So this is my instance, just click on the instance and uh, go to the party. As you know, I have already logged in, fine. So I am saying sudo su, if you are not familiar, I am just going to show you that how can you open your, so click on the putty, okay click on the putty, so you have to use the host name, go to your instance, click on the connect, copy this one and paste this one here. Click on the connection, click on the SSH and also click on the auth. Give your .pp, .ppk file, click on the open, click on the open button. Fine, you have successfully logged in with your key. Now, so find, go to the Google, find the Vesta CP, sorry, it's Vesta CP. That means control panel. So this is the official website of the Vesta, vestacp.com. Click on the Vesta control panel link. So now as you can see simple and clever hosting control panel. So as you can see Amazon Web Services, fine. You can also view the entire text from here. You can create the backups, client interface and a lot of things available here. So built in uh, the MySQL, FTP, mail, web and also the DNS functionality available so if you click on the pricing so it's totally free but you can pay three dollar per month or 18 dollar lifetime for the commercial clients you can also click on the features page it's not working i don't know why fine click on the download as you can see you can install the Vesta in Ubuntu and also some other flavors available here. So install instructions and we can see connect your server as root via SSH. So that's why we are saying sudo su. So this is the root and now copy this one, paste this one here, click on the enter button. It's fine. Now copy this one and click on the paste this here and click on the enter button as you can see it's saying you have to use the force so I'm saying double dash force click on the enter button fine so you're going to install these things Nijx, Apache and also some other stuff here I'm saying yes and please enter the email address. I'm giving my email address. Hit the enter button and it's saying please enter Vesta port number. I'm saying 8083. Now please enter host name. So where you can get this host name. So go to your instance. As you can see, this is your instance, and here, as you can see, this is the public IPv4 DNS. Just copy this one or click on the copy, go to the section, paste, and hit the enter button. And say it, installing will take about 15 minutes. So now it's installing the Vesta control panel in your EC2 instance. So it takes 15 minutes to install the Vesta panel in your CP sorry in your instance
it's installing the php 7.2 and also the mysql and installing a lot of things available in vesta control panel It's 98% com completed. So guys, it's about to complete the entire setup. You will get the username and also the password. So keep username and also the password at the safe place because we use the username and password while login with the Vesta panel. Okay guys, so you have successfully installed the Vesta control panel in your EC2 instance. So now you have the link and also you have the username and also the password. So you can easily access the URL and use the credentials. Okay guys, so in this way you can install the Vesta control panel in your EC2 instance. So I hope guys you are enjoying our series. If you think we are doing good. Feel free to share our courses and also the videos and don't forget to click on the subscribe button so you never miss any update. So thank you for watching.